Who's king of the drag strip? The $120,000 single passenger, 1,025 horsepower, wheelie popping Dodge Demon 170 with its 6.2 liter supercharged V8 running on super high octane E85 fuel, or my daily driver, the five passenger, $89,000 Tesla Model S Plaid. It's got three electric motors making 1,020 horsepower. In this video, I team up with Racer X to find out who wins down the drag strip at Bradenton Motorsports Park. Hey everybody, Brooks from Dragtown here. Welcome back to our channel. We're at Bradenton Motorsports Park for an epic day. You see it behind me. Paul, Racer X's Demon 170 against, you got it, Tesla Plaid. You ready for this? I'm ready. Oh yeah. man. You know, I'm gonna get some test hits and we're gonna let it uh, we're gonna let it go. We already know your car's unbelievably fast, but we're we're gonna give it a go, man. I Look. feel like I gotta hold it down for the internal combustion guys if I can. This demon is not like the old demons, which had trouble performing. These are coming right out of the box, yeah. running low nines. I think someone might have got an eight with some weight reduction. We gotta check it out. I feel like you already did weight reduction. Well, I, I mean, think I've got the I don't know if this is stock. That, I don't, I've got the full weight. What, but did it come with a seat? It's a bit, mine did, but so, you can order it without it. I know that, but you so, had a seat. You have seats in here and you took so, them out. I did. I All took right, so it's not stock seat. anymore. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Come on. <laughs> All right, so check it out. Let's see what we got in here. We got nothing. Look at that. Can, can you take a passenger down the drag strip? Um, I will. Okay. Sit, just sit right where my helmet is. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so there you go. This is Demon 170. Now, you can get it equipped like this with no passenger seat. He just took it out. The no, there's no rear seats as well. Right. And you can see the back. They just, they want to save every ounce of weight. Uh, this is the full weight wheel. This is not the carbon fiber wheel. So there are optional carbon fiber wheels. Uh, so how many miles you got? I've got right around 800 miles. So it's all broken in. We're on E85 today. The car's stock. Stock on E85, so it should make full power. Okay, you already dynoed it. It made 900 horsepower to the wheels. Right about nine to the wheel as well. You have a lot more work to do than I do. I do. We're also on a pro tree, which is terrible for the Tesla. Yeah. That's going to be, if, if we can get a good launch. Yeah. Because this is all about what the cars will do, right? I agree. Because if I'm treeing you or you're treeing me, right. we're not really getting to see what the cars I will do. I totally agree. And so I feel like that is really the whole point of this video was what car is really faster. Now we're in right. Florida, so we got pretty good DA. This is like yeah. perfect track conditions. A little bit of sun, yeah. the track has temperature. Yeah. DA this morning was negative 500. It's probably a little positive now. It's a little positive, so yeah. So it might be like 500 right now yeah. but good for you bad for me because i don't need da no you don't need just any do you, just, you just get it I would, my, I would hope it got really hot for you but well yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> just, yeah. well like i said just, as long as i hook it i think it'll, it'll be a good race i think yeah, if man. i'm spinning that ain't winning you know all how right that goes, so. well you got to make some test passes i'm gonna go make some tests so let's see some i don't need any test passes no i'm all plugged in over here i'm actually trickle charging at the track just to get mine ready and uh yeah what do you guys got tesla plot this video is going to be absolutely nuts buddy i hope so dude because there's nothing more polarizing than gas versus electric hey, and now we have the ultimate drag car yeah this is literally the fastest car quickest car you can buy right if you talk about performance per dollar this is where it's at yeah uh, i'm at ninety thousand. you're at 108 was my stick 108 no no adjustment you paid sticker i paid sticker you lucky man well that's how we do it in the pros you know? that is awesome <laughs> All right, buddy, let's go. let's go. Check them out, Racer X on YouTube. These Demon 170s are completely sold out, but I've got you covered. I've just launched a new dealership with my cousins, and we've got a Demon 170 available right now, as well as my Ferrari SF90. Head over to magnummotors.com to secure it and view our other inventory from Ferrari, Lamborghini, Porsche, McLaren, and more. Also, follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Links down in the description. All right, here we go. Race one, Demon 170 versus Plaid on a pro tree. This is not my normal kind of race, uh, but it is what it is, and this is what we gotta do. So uh, 
Hopefully I can get into the right modes and get a decent launch. This thing's popping wheelies in first and second gear. He's doing his burnout right now. I got him off the line. One, four, nine, 60 footer. He's got a one, six, eight. I got him. Yes. At least I squeaked out one win. And of course, we got to break hard. Oof. I am not used to the pro tree. I have no idea what I ran because I don't have the draggy. I should have put that in. Hopefully, the boards are still let up and we can see. But we got one for the Tesla. Let's go. I'm pretty surprised. I don't know if he came off the light slow or he didn't have a good launch we started a state of charge at 96 percent we are down to 92. all right here we go round two demon versus plaid i got a 940 not bad not bad but let's see man it is if he gets that launch he got last time i'm done do a little dry hop here Gauging launch. Staged up. Oh, he got off the line, but I passed him. No way, we're dead. Oh, I got him by a nose. One four nine sixty footer again. That pro tree, I'm just not ready for it. I don't know what else to say. I I need some practice. He fucked, he totally got me. I don't know what happened if he slipped a little bit and then, oh man, let's talk to him and see what happened here. Wow, dude, we were neck and neck, holy crap. It's spinning. Is it spinning off the line? What? It's spinning right off the shot? Wow. Damn. You wanna do one more and then you can try the trans brake and if we wanna redo it again afterwards? All right, round three. Unfortunately, he's spinning a little bit. He's not cutting those 60 foots like he did before. Um, it's just not as consistent. And they did do a lot of prep work on the track. Maybe he's just got to do a little bigger burnout. I'm not exactly sure. But let me see if I can clean the tires. All right, he's doing a burnout. <laughs> If he cuts that one 360 footer and gets me on the tree again, I'm done. All right, here he comes. Woo! Heart rate's up. Here we go. It doesn't look like you have an app named Heart Rates Up. Here we go. You can search for it in the App Store. On the engage launch, he's gonna bump up. I gotta go on the flash. Go! Oh, here we go! All 
Oh, he let off. One, four, nine. I'm gonna keep going. It's just consistency. All, that's all I gotta say is like that thing when you got no pressure, not to say he's not good at pressure because he's a really good racer, but it's a lot to handle when you're doing that. You know what I mean? So, and if he's spinning, you can't launch. Even with those big tires and the track prep and everything, Tesla's all wheel drive is just ridiculous. It just freaking goes. That's three, one, four, nine, 60 footers in a row. Um, I imagine that's another nine, four run. And uh, I think he wants to let it cool down and maybe we can regroup and do some more races. He could try the trans brake. We got more time. 9.39 at 1.47. My car's doing great. A little inconsistent. Yeah, Shit. well, a lot inconsistent. We're spinning, so we really haven't got a good run in. Yeah. Um, it's, it's, just, it's been a little bit of a weird thing. I mean, your car's running good. Nine, I mean, as expected. Nine, yeah, four, like I we'll said, it's, like a freaking all, it's a computer on wheels, man. It just um, goes. It was really weird that in practice, like on my test hits, that the car just went, right? No. Like. And then and all of a sudden, it's like as soon as I go to the second gear shift, it is literally like hopping off the ground. Yeah. So the second run, you actually, I, I think I, I was out on you a little bit. Car kind of came off the ground. You kind of went straight around me, and I don't have enough power to reel you in. The yeah. car's too fast. I so. thought in the second round I was donezo. Man, and in the third round, what happened? You just spun and let off? Spun right off the hip, okay. man. Like, right. so, so unfortunately, like it, it came out. Car tire, I mean, just looked fantastic. It wrinkled. Car lifted up. And then all of a sudden, right on the second gear hit, car hit and, and something made the car jump off the ground yeah and it was just a violent shake so when, yeah. when that happens you got to let out you of break, course break the car yeah no i got um, it i mean you were in 939 939 earlier and, and that my was best on my one, second pass and my best one is 939 so we need to get that done we got to get it done maybe the prep was a little different earlier I, i'm not sure what the deal was the car was running it had yeah. pretty, two pretty good passes yeah. on practice so yeah you got internal combustion versus electric it's like apples and oranges it and is. this is the part this is the part of racing it's that's so, so polarizing tough. you know what i mean sometimes it's like doesn't matter how much you prep it's yeah. like sometimes you come yeah. out in the car um just it doesn't hook yeah. or whatever happens and, and so the tesla is just rock solid consistent I, on pisses me off is just, what it does it just does but what it does knew, over and over again we knew that going into well, it. i knew the pressure's on you of course and that's fine of course you know? and, um all right so regroup Maybe we'll get some more runs in. I mean, it's I'm a busy a little, day. Little tire pressure he, out it's, too. He needs the cool down time uh, or something like that. Yeah, we gotta let it. I don't need the cool hot. down. It's hot. Uh, it's nice out Go here. Go cool your Tesla down. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we might be back with some more races. If we're not, we'll do a wrap up in a little bit. We'll try it out. Okay. So there you go. We are regrouping now, and uh, Paul had a few more runs. I guess the track just over today yeah. is deteriorating, and they keep trying to prep it, but. It's just not there. It's not holding the power, man. No, it is so. what it is. But the car seems to be fine. It's just I can't get it to hook, man. Yeah. We know the plaid, what it does. I mean, that's, that's the uh, thing. I knew I was up against it. I mean, everything has to be perfect. Yeah. And when you don't hook, man. Listen, I was stressed 100%. I'm like, pro tree, not good for me. He just ran 939, lifting the wheels off in two gears. And I'm yeah. like, all right, if he gets out, I'm done. Yeah. But, you know, look, it's racing. It is racing. And it doesn't always go the way you planned. Well, and th the truth is, is the plaid, I mean, you know, you, it's going to just do its thing every time. So yeah. when you're up against something like this, it doesn't really matter what it is. If it's an ice engine, it's going to be tough. We know it'll do it. It's just a matter of how often 100%. will it do it. If you yeah. put 10 races together, yeah. how's that going to look? You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I'm but, taking the plaid out of 10. Are you? I, it's good. I think a lot of people would probably agree with that. Well, maybe not, because um, the plaid drops a little bit. I mean, actually, I ran three consecutive 940, 939, 939. And not, I had no performance drop at all. That is pretty And I probably good. had another five passes in it before it really drops yeah. off. Demon versus Plaid round one is in the books. As always, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. Help us a video in the channel. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. See ya.